good day great student today we are working on project one of seven technician your school offers several computer courses to prepare students for occupations as desktop support technician you are updating pages for their new course catalog let's start off by doing task one task one says add page numbering to the bottom of all pages in the accent bar for format. So in order to do this, we're gonna first click on the insert tab. And we're going to head to the header and footer group. And we're looking for page number. Select page number. We're gonna scroll down until we select bottom of page. And we're gonna scroll and look for accent bar four. Select it here. And then we're going to select close header and footer. Mark task completed. On to task two. Task two says add the tag course to the document. That is going to be in our backstage file view. So we're going to click on the file tab. In the left window pane, we're going to select info. We're going to select properties. We don't have to select advanced properties because we already see tags is here. We're going to type in course. And then we're going to click the back button. Task two, mark completed. Task three. Task three says display the paragraph marks on the document. So in order to do that, we're already on the Home tab. We're going to scroll all the way up, and you'll see the Paragraph Show Hide Mark button. Select it, and you should see the Show Hide button. Mark Task 3 completed. We're going to move on to Task 4. Task 4 says simultaneously delete all the comments. In order to do that, we're going to click on one of the comments to reveal the delete command, so just pick one. We're going to go to the review tab. And in the comments group, you'll see the delete option. Click the drop down arrow and select delete all comments in document. Mark task four completed. Let's move on to task five. Task five says Add a table with six rows and two columns on the last page between the headings grading and course length. So we're going to click in the space between the headings grading and course length. So I'm going to scroll down to get to the last page. We see grading and course length. So we we'll click here. And we're going to go to the insert tab. So click here. And we're going to select the tables group. Anywhere it says insert table for the number of columns. Columns go up and down and rows go across. So columns is going to be two and then rows we're going to go all the way down to six. So you should have six. Accept all of the defaults. Mark as completed and then we're going to grade it.